Hello everyone, this is Mr. Langford with K-12 Private Academy, and with summer getting here, there's a lot of fun with summer activities. One of my favorite ones is hiking. Now, if you're going to go hiking, you know, if you're going to go hiking in your neighborhood, then all you need is a good pair of sneakers and some uh, water with you. But if you're going to go hiking in the woods, you need some equipment, just like any other sport. Let's start at the bottom. The first thing you're going to need is a good pair of hiking boots. Now, hiking boots are important because they protect your ankles uh, from tur getting turned on rocks and things like that. You also need good socks. Good thick socks will keep you from getting blisters while you're walking. The next thing you're going to need is a backpack. Now, backpacks are good because you got to carry stuff. There are things that you need to have when you're there. Uh, along with a backpack, you need water. You need water and you need lots of water. You, you don't want to get out in the woods and have, you know, too little water and be thirsty out there because that can be dangerous. Uh, and the great thing about hydration when you're hiking is that every time you drink, your pack gets a little lighter. Uh, the next thing that you can use is uh, some food. You're going to need some food and the food that you take depends on what you're doing. Uh, if you're going on a short hike and you don't mind carrying a lot of weight, then you can take a whole picnic with you and that can be very nice. Uh, I like to carry some protein bars with me because they work great for a you know, food source. You can eat those, they're good. And they fill you up while you're out hiking and don't weigh a lot. You also can use a jacket. Now, jackets are important. And you may say, well, if it's hot in the summer, why do you need a jacket? Well, it depends on where you're walking. If you're walking in your neighborhood or on somewhere that's basically level, then you probably don't need a jacket. But if you're climbing and you're going up in the mountains, remember the higher you get, the cooler it gets. So while it could be pretty warm where you start, once you get to the top, it might be kind of cold. Another thing that you can use are hiking sticks. Now the hiking sticks, these, these are, are great because these are your four wheel drive for hiking. You can use these to get up trails, get down trails, keep your balance, they're great. Just make sure that they are adjusted correctly. These should be adjusted so that they are basically, your arm is gonna be parallel to the ground when you're walking with them. Uh, past that, you need a hat and glasses. Those will keep you out of the sun. Another really important thing is a good GPS system. There's a lot of good GPS apps on your phone that you can use so you don't get lost in the woods. That's, that's not going to be a, a fun hike if you get lost in the woods. So that's great. Uh, and there are some other things you need. Maybe a first aid kit, things like that are always good. What you carry is up to you. Now, I did leave out one thing. I left out one thing intentionally uh, that is pretty important, but not absolutely essential. I'll see if you can figure out what it is. But uh, think about it. Think about what you would like to take on a hike and think about what uh, maybe we left out of this that could be essential. Anyway, uh, that's the direction I'm going. So uh, we will see you at the end of the trail. Get out and go something. I'm going that way. Where are you going? Bye.